Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone Captain. Today we're going to be doing the top 10 lock screens for your iPhone 5 or the iPod Touch 5th generation. Uh, these probably would work on the iPhone 4 and 4S as well, but they have been iPhone 5, 5S tested, so I would recommend them for those devices personally. So as you see here on the screen, I have Stormtrooper for wallpaper, and that's easily changed if you don't want that. But as you can see, too, I'm also uh, showing a lot of different things. Here on the left side, I have a little pop-out menu here. And here you can change your location, time, uh, Celsius. Uh, you can change the unlock style, light or dark. If you want white or black, I guess you should say. Uh, light or dark type. Face and you've got uh, null in this little thing down here. You can change that, I'm sure, very easily by going in down here to bottom and the, tap the unlock. And right here, you can type in text and you can type in previous text. Just hit OK. I don't even remember what that was, but you can that that should have changed it. It may require a respring. I'm not sure. But let's just change it to something different than that. Let you see what it. Okay, let's go with uh, just something silly, just so we know. No, it does change it on the fly. But I'm also using Jelly Lock Seven, and this lock screen that you see here on the screen that I'm using now, this is called Concept LS by June's iPhone. This guy is an awesome developer. He does superb work. I mean, everything about it just screams awesomeness. And I really and truly love this lock screen. I use it a lot. And as you can see, I, you got your weather up here in the corner. That's easily set right here by location. If you want a 24-hour time, you can change that right here as well as Celsius or whatever. Here's where you change your background. You just tap the little BG and you and you whatever you're in your camera roll you can have for a wallpaper it's that simple very very simple to change guys um and this isn't a tutorial about how to use this but i'm showing you some of the features it has over here you have a quick comp compose or reply ever how you want to look at it you can also open your music app you see i can open uh email just by tapping that it's a little slight by, I should say, not tapping, but using the little slider. And let's go back up here at the top and swipe it out. You can also open your music app just by swiping down. You see that's that, that fast and that simple. There's just so much to this lock screen, guys. And that's one of them I'm going to share with you today. Now we're going to move on to some of the others. This is Concept LS for iOS 7 right here. I'll have these listed in the description as well and on the screen so you'll know what to get. All right, guys. Now, I'm going to show you how to sh how to change these as well. Simply, uh, I'm also using the 20-second lock screen uh, to make my lock screen display longer. So, we're going to change it from uh, Concept LS over to something else now. And we're just going to come in here to Groovy Lock, and I'm going to enable that. And in here, I've got five different things, free lock screens by June's iPhone as well. Um, he made these for us for nothing. So I would, I would think a small donation would be appreciated, even a dollar. I mean, if that's all you can afford, give him a buck. It takes dollars to make fives, guys. And you can change your theme by right here. Uh, I'm going to go with the CLS clock. And then go back out here, and we also have to turn off that concept LS. We haven't turned it off yet. So let's go ahead and in here's something totally different. I'm going to turn that concept LS off right now. So let's go back out. We're using something different and hit a respring. All right, we're back up now. Look how awesome that is, guys. Now, these are the free ones. These are five free uh, lock screens right here. You see you got your date and time up there at the top. 
You're also going to have to use something to hide your clock and date. Uh, I recommend Custom LS. There is a, another one out there called Lock Screen Tool. You can get it. Both of them are free. But, you know, it's just whatever you prefer. So that's one of them. So let's go in here now and change this up a little bit and look at these these others. Uh, Typo 5 is pretty awesome in, in itself too, guys. Uh, so let's hit a respring. Here's what they look like with uh, Concept LS. This is the free version. Now, this one here, seeing here, this is called Typo 5. Uh, these are all going to be found in the Patrick Muff repo to get this. And there's a lot of different things in here that you'll want to check out. But I'm showing you some of the awesome things that I use right here. All right, here's an analog clock. And you can see it's awesome, too. Uh, all these look really nice with uh, Jelly Lock on them. So let's go ahead and let me show you some more of these. I know that's what you're wanting. And now we're looking at some of the groovy lock, lock screens. And this one here is called CLS Clock. I can show you what the, these look like pretty fast because it doesn't require a respring. This HUD has got this little thing up here in the corner which I wouldn't recommend this one if this wallpaper. All right, guys, we've got a respring here that's taking place. And you see now we have a different wallpaper. And that's how easy it does require a respring, though, to change the wallpaper. And here's that's what CLS Nexus look like. Look at that, how cool. But, you know, you've got five inside that concept LS I showed you. And now let me show you uh, one that I use a whole lot. All right, guys, look how awesome this is. That's clouds that you're seeing on the screen right there floating through because it says it's cloudy outside, 28 degrees, and the high today was 32. The low is supposed to be 19, and we can even animate this weather on our springboard if we want to and you see that I have the clouds there on my springboard as well but if you don't want that you can turn that off simply by going into the settings going down to forecast right here and right here you can choose show current weather darken current weather on the lock screen and show forecast page darken the forecast page and right here you can show wallpapers on the lock screen home screen animate wallpaper right there if you don't want it shown on the home screen you can turn it off but it does require a respring it says that's called forecast guys and it's 99 cents and i can't exactly remember it's in one of the primary repos you won't have any trouble finding it but i was going to show you once you uh disable that you see now that we don't have the clouds on the springboard it's that easy all right guys i wanted to show you what it looked like here with jelly lock forecast and analog clock enabled the uh, Patrick Muff repo so this is analog clock so guys I hope you enjoyed the video today please give me a thumbs up if you did I really appreciate it and, I, and it would really help me out a great deal if you shared this on Facebook and Twitter and as always guys keep coming back